Shower Sommier time. This time on Shower Sommier is with Bubbles. Yeah, because everybody loves Bubbles. Champagne, baby. Andre Clouet. One of the largest family ownings of Grand Cru Pinot Noir in Bouzy, Champagne, France. I know what your first question is. Pinot Noir, but white wine? That's weird. Yes, we get the color from the skin of the grapes. Remove the skin? No color. I know the next question is, you're not drinking out of a champagne flute. I'm not. I'm not a big fan of champagne flutes. I can't get the aromatics. With this, totally, totally. Some of you may have noticed a sword in that opening. Yes. I was going to save her in the shower and then thought, eh, probably not a great idea. I mean, to be fair, we still have a couple hours left in 2016. It kind of been a little bit of a bitch. Just discussing and thinking about 2016 makes you want to skip the glass. What a year. But let's get back to the drink on hand, champagne. How do you get those bubbles in there? Well, it's not like Coca-Cola. It's not forced in. So let's talk about it. First, the grapes are picked. Then they're crushed. They're turned into juice. And then they start going through a fermentation, usually in a steel tank. Then after fermentation, they're put into a bottle, usually sealed like a beer bottle, honestly. And then they sit, and they usually sit on the side. The bottle sitting on its side allows the sediment to slowly develop, and then it's slowly rotated, so all the sediment goes to the very top. Then you freeze the neck, and that little block slides out after you pop the top. You put a little still wine in with a little bit of sugar and yeast. You put a cork in it. The other fun thing about most champagnes is they're non-vintage. That's because the weather is typically pretty bad in champagne, and they blend all the vintages together to make sure that you're always getting a good bottle. I could go on and on and on about champagne, but I'm running out of hot water. So I'll wish you all a happy New Year's. May 2017 be far, far better than 2016. As the great Napoleon said, champagne, in victory, you deserve it, and in defeat, you need it. Happy New Year's.